Hi everyone, my name is Monique. And I'm Naveen from Before You Play. And today we're going to be playing through a game that is currently on Kickstarter called Kabuto Sumo Sakura Slam. Yes, this game is designed by Tony Miller, Michael Dunsmore, as well as John Brieger and published by All Play, who are helping sponsor this playthrough. It is springtime, Sakura season. The trees are in bloom and we are taking on the roles of insect sumo wrestlers who are vying for the coveted belt. Yes, this is a game for two to four players in which players are going to be trying to knock their insect uh, sumo opponents off of the ring. Mm -hmm. This game can be played fully competitive or in teams, and there's also a junior league variant for a more simplified gameplay. And for those who are familiar with the original Kabuto Sumo, even though this is an expansion, it's completely standalone, which means you don't need the base game in order to play it, but you can mix and match the new wrestlers. And so today, we're going to start with a very quick teach of the game because the rules are very straightforward, and then we'll go straight into our two-player playthrough. But before we begin, we do need to mention that everything that you see here is considered a prototype copy of the game, which means things are subject to change in the future. Now, if you are interested in the game, there's gonna be a link in the description down below, which you can check out at your leisure. Lastly, if you like these kind of videos and you wanna see more in the future, Future, please consider subscribing. And with that, we are ready to begin. So if you'd please direct your attention to the center of the table, we're all set up here for a two-player game of Kabuto Sumo Sakura Slam. Welcome to the ring. Square. Now, if you've never played the original, in this game, we are playing as various insect wrestlers who are trying to knock the other player off of the ring. And so today, I'm going to be playing as the purple player, and I am Midas, the golden orb weaver. Very good. I am going to be playing as the red insect. I am the liquefier, aka the assassin bug. Ooh, scary. Now, the way that the game works is we are going to be taking turns pushing one piece from our inventory into the ring in order to try to push our opponent's piece off of the ring. Mm -hmm. In a standard game, each player starts with one medium piece as well as two small pieces, but each player's insect also has a signature piece which starts in the supply and not in their inventory. Because I am a golden orb weaver, my signature piece is a golden web. Very nice. And as the liquefier, I have these two X's that I hope to deploy. Now, to be clear, you're only pushing one piece from your inventory. But if on your turn, you're able to knock off any pieces from the board, they will go into your supply so that you can now push them into the ring, I guess, on a future turn. Yeah, more ammo for you. Right. Now, depending on your insect, each player will also have a couple of signature moves. But that is the basic concept of what we're going to be doing here. And in this game, there are three ways in which you can win. You can win by knocking out your opponent, which is basically knocking their piece off of the ring. Mm -hmm. You can win by submission, which is basically when your opponent runs out of pieces in their inventory and cannot take a turn. Or specifically in a two-player game, as you can see here, the championship title belt <laughs> is in the middle of the ring. And so if either player is able to knock the belt off of the ring, then they win. Now for anyone who is familiar with the original Kabuto Sumo, there are some new changes to this version of the game, namely the uh, shape of the ring, as well as the new four fixed corner posts that players can use to their advantage. There is also a new tagging mechanic, which we'll get into as we start the game. But we're going to go ahead and get started. But first, we need to see who's going first. Yeah, rock Ready? scissors, yes. yes. Paper. All right, scissors, it's me. Monique. So since Naveen is going second, you actually get to start by placing one of your tags on one of the four corner posts. Do you get a little consolation? Let's just go ahead and place it right there. All right. Okay. So now I'm gonna go ahead and take my turn. And so the first thing that you do on your turn is you have to establish where you're going to push your piece from. Sure. So with this new ring shape, you actually choose one of the four corners to place your ramp. So I am going to go ahead and uh, I think I'll push from here. Since okay. again, I am the purple insect. Okay. And after you've chosen your corner, you're going to place one of your four tag tokens on it if you don't already have one there. So this new tagging mechanic basically uh, allows you to take another turn if you've placed a token on all four corners. So basically it's a new way for you to take turns back to back. Yep. So now I'm gonna push a piece and I think I'm gonna start with a small one <laughs> since it's the start of the game. Sure. And the only rule here is it has to go in a straight line. Uh, you don't have to go into the center of the ring, but it has to be straight and you have to stop as soon as your piece leaves the platform. Mm -hmm. Now we might cheat a little. <laughs> <laughs> We're not very good at uh, stuff like this, but we'll do our best. Ready? Okay, good luck. Here we go. I'm gonna go this way. Easy. All right. All right, so Monique got one piece into her own supply, so yes. one for one. I knocked this piece off uh, when I pushed uh, my piece in, sure. so I get to put this into my supply. If ever a piece falls off, not a, as a part of your move, then it does not go into your inventory. But that's essentially it for my turn. So the gameplay is very simple. We're gonna go uh, back and forth quite a bit. All right. Um, and just so you know, my signature moves here, by the way, are Strands of Fate, 
which says when I place my third corner tag, that is when I gain my golden web. And it's essentially a much larger piece uh, that I can push in. Yep. But it also has to do with my second signature move, the golden touch, which says at the beginning of my turn, if my wrestler is touching this piece, then I can tag a corner. So my insect basically allows me to tag much quicker so right. that I can basically take that powerful back-to-back -back move uh, much faster. And so you mean if this particular piece, yes. your uh, purple wrestler, touches right. that golden touching web. touching this golden web. Mm. Okay, so it's going to go to me, and I've identified the corner that I want to manipulate. So okay. we're going to go ahead and toss this right over here. <laughs> Okay. So I'm going to put out my uh, second tag. So if I can put one out here and here, I'll be able to take back-to-back -back turns. Yes. And when, you, uh, when you're when you pushing from this corner, you can choose this side or this side. Right. So this is the side that you want to go? That's the side because go? I'm seeing this low-hanging fruit here. Ah. So if I fail on this, then you know that I made a boo-boo. Okay. All right. So I am going to push from, I think I want to go kind of like this and okay. try to ricochet that way. All right. All right. Straight line. Wish me luck. Good mommy. luck. <laughs> Please. I did it. I right, did, right. I did, I did. Okay. Okay, okay. So it's a one for one. I'm just trying to get your purple piece a little closer to the edge. Okay. But that's my turn, and my two signature moves that I want to talk about is I have marked target. If I knock off two pieces or more on a particular turn, then they gain one of these X pieces that are not in my current supply. Oh, okay. And then wet work says at the beginning of your turn, if both of my X pieces are on the board, I may push an additional piece from the same platform position. Ah, so you, mine is uh, wants me to tag a lot, mm -hmm. and yours basically allows you to push more pieces. It just wants me to get these out on the board. All right. Well, it's back to me, and I think I'm going to choose this corner here. Okay. I oops, <laughs> I do not have a tag, so I'll place one now, and I'm going to choose another small piece. So, uh, what angle do I want to do this in? Careful, don't hurt, go, your, don't hurt your purple piece now. I am going to try. I'm going to go like this. Okay? <laughs> okay. One, two, three. Straight line. Okay. All right. Is this just one? That's just, just one. one. Just one. All right. In an ideal world, we would be able to walk around the table and sort of push straight. Yeah. But uh, we don't have that flexibility We're in right an now. ideal world. There right. Go. Okay. okay. So now it goes to you. Oh, man. This is such a juicy spot right here. So well, I would not be able to tag again, but I could go here and try to knock both of these off at the same time. I mean, you could go here and tag this corner and push I this could. way. I could. Just but a little bit of a harder angle for you. There's a couple things going on. I could potentially manipulate your purple towards the edge, making yeah. you have to be defensive and, and tag over here. Okay. So I think I'm going to do it. I'm going to go and place this here because if I'm able to knock off again two pieces, yeah. then I get my X's. That's true. So I think I want to try to get... I'm, I'm gunning for this. Okay. <laughs> so I'm gonna, <laughs> this is what I'm trying to do With here. a small piece? With a... So, okay. Well, you only have one medium piece. <laughs> you only have one medium piece. All right, I'll Decisions. do it. Decisions. I'll do it. You, you convince me. Okay. All right. Straight line. Straightest I mean. of lines. Oh, my gosh. Please. I, Please. Nice. Wow. Yes. Oh, my gosh. That was so good yes. for you. So I got three. You got three. So that was worth it. So now, because I've done this, I got marked target. If you knock two or more pieces off on your turn, you get to gain one of these. At the I'll end of your turn. I'm take this beautiful little X. So I did not get to tag this because I already have a tag there. Okay. Well, that is not the greatest <laughs> for me. So uh, I'm going to go here. Okay. I want this piece. It's a good one. It is, but I just, I don't know what vantage point i guess to use yeah anyway i'm gonna tag this corner okay and because it is my third tag i gain my golden web just use it now i'm not going to use it yet <laughs> <laughs> no you want to typically probably use it somewhere closer to your piece so that you can take advantage of it i'll only have one opportunity to mm -hmm. do this because once it's on the board i basically can't take it back until it gets knocked off and goes back into the supply yep so uh, do i want to go do i want to go for it Maybe I'll go for it. I'm going to use my medium piece. Okay. And this is going to be a little bit difficult for me because I'm doing it this way. Good luck. But I'm going to pull, pull, I guess, yeah. in a straight line mm. this way. Ready? Put me in the center. One, two, three. Pink in Keep the center. Keep going until, Stop. is it off the board? Stop right there. Perfect. Ah, oh, not good. Oh, yeah. It's off the platform. Oh, my oh, god! Excellent. excellent, excellent, excellent. This is so bad. <laughs> and my 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 wrestler is, is so close is to the in edge. in danger. Well, that is the end of my turn. Yeah, no need to move the platform. I think I like that. You right do? Where it is, yeah. Well, so, go ahead and tag it. Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and tag it. So now I'm on three of the four uh, corner posts. Okay. I'm going to have to do this pull thing right here. I, I want this. <laughs> I also want this. So I'm going to I'm gonna take a chance. Go get it, Naveen. I just can't figure out, like, if I push here, this is going to carom that. All right, let's just do it. <laughs> 
Okay. What's your straight line? Uh, my straight line is going to be this. I'm just going to move these just so I don't knock these over and, okay. and cause a boo-boo. It's part of the challenge. It's a part of the, yeah. Okay. <laughs> so let's go ahead and just okay. let's push. We use one finger. Oh, my gosh. One finger on a pull? Yeah, right. just, just pull. All right. Okay. Straight I'm, line. Uh, the post is in my way. Sorry. Uh, All right. Okay, I failed. That was a wow, big Wow, that was, you went further. <laughs> well, <laughs> in an That's ideal fine. world, as we said, I would be standing there and it's not fine, fine, hooking fine, around this. All right. Well, uh, these pieces go back they on there. Do. I set you up, though. So if I want to, to be able to take uh, multiple turns back to back, mm -hmm. I have to go from this corner. You tag that one. Because that is the only corner that I don't have a tag on. And when I take a second turn, by the way, it has to be from the same post. Exactly. So I, I have to want to be able to do it back to back from this corner. Yeah, it's dangerous because your purple piece is all the way over there. I know. I It's not ideal. So maybe I won't do that just yeah, yet. That's fair. And I'll go back here. You got to be defensive. I have to be defensive. But I am going to go ahead and use my golden web. I think you can get these two big pieces if you do, if you do this right. I'm trying to get this piece. I yeah. think we both have been trying, but I'm going to go so like close. this. I hope you fail. You think? What yeah. do you think? Yeah. <laughs> this way? Uh, All right. I can't One, do. two, three. Come, oh, come on. on. Miss. Please. Miss. Yes. Uh, I didn't miss. I still got one. Well, I mean, like, in my perspective. <laughs> <laughs> We're hanging on. <laughs> because, again, you either have to knock off your yeah. opponent's piece or run out of pieces. So well, we're, we're doing well uh, in terms of pieces. What's great about this situation is this is exactly where I want to be, and it's my final and fourth tag. So okay. I'm going to be able to take two turns back to back from this location. Right. So I'm going to start off by putting out my X piece. So hopefully I can knock off two things at once. Okay. Would you like me to move? Uh, you know, I think this is a very crucial time. We're going time. to swap places. Yeah. Okay. So this is the place I want to be. And I think I'm going to push kind of diagonal. The spinny thing. I, I think I could take advantage spinny of it. Thing. I can try to like twist it and spin everything down this way. Around the post? You Around mean? the post. Well, no, oh. I'm saying using like this corner here. Oh, my web. And then like, yeah, using your you? web to my advantage. So I'm going to, I'm going to do it from a point to point. Okay. Oh, I don't know what I'm talking Such about. Such strategy. Yeah, right. <laughs> All right. Okay, straight line. Straight line is straighting. straighting. I didn't do exactly what I wanted, but Keep one, going. two. Okay, okay you're perfect. off. I'm off. All right, oh, great. I got the piece that I, I wanted. I did. So I got this piece, and because I am marked target, I get my second X. So again, if I have two of these on the board, uh -huh. then that means I could take another turn. Wow. Now, since it's the end of my turn and I have tags on each of the four corners, I get to remove all four of these tags. Yes. And, and I get again. to go again. Yeah. So from there, from exactly there, which is not bad, which is interesting because if you push your other X, mm -hmm. then you can activate wet works to go again. Uh, well, actually, no, it's at the beginning of your turn. That's if right. Both of these are on the board. So you'd have to wait till your next turn. So this could be the setup for, for my next, next turn, which yeah. I will do. So I do not get to tag here as, as my additional. Uh, okay. So, okay. Here we go. Uh -huh. X to X connection. Here we go. I <laughs> am going. Oh. oh, my God. Please. <laughs> oh, that was nothing. Nice. That's I was beautiful. really trying to get that one over there, but well, I failed. So then it's back to me. And before we switch places again, um, I am going to stay here because I'm actually going to push from... A little defense. Here. I think so. And you get right? to go back to back if you or do should it. I push this way? What is the best? Okay, I will say your huh. gold is super close to your sumo wrestler. If there's some way that you can make them touch then you have your golden touch. Yeah, I don't know that I'm going to be able to do that. <laughs> yeah, if you defensively push it into it. I will try from here. Okay. So. Don't take my pieces. You're over here. Yeah, I know. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to start with a small one because I will be able to go again. Okay. Uh, is the thing. So maybe if I push this way, like towards, like in here, so it pushes my piece this way. Does okay. that make sense? See what you got. I don't know about the physics of this. Ready? Nice and slow. Straight line. Fail. Okay, it's oh. on. Nice. All that right. going to hold. That's for me. I guess that's one, so. That's one. Now that I'm fully tagged, I'm going to go again. Is your gold piece touching? From here. My oh, gold I, I piece gotta... is touching right there. It says at the beginning of your turn, so I, it's on, on my turn. I should try to break that up. If your wrestler is yeah. touching, you may tag a corner. Now, even though I'm going again, this is technically not the beginning of my turn. Mm -hmm. uh, the tagging just lets me push another piece. Yep. So I might as well try to go for it, right? And yeah. secure it. I don't know what angle to try to get. You are so in the middle. Mm -hmm. It's such a problem. That's the plan. All right. I'm going to just go this way because I'm not creative. Here we go. That's okay. pretty good. At least I got a big piece. Yeah, good momentum there. And I'm definitely touching now. All right. That you are. So now it's back to you. Would you like to re-switch? Uh, you know, so I do have my two X's here. I think I'm going to stay right here. So I, I can just stand or sit here at the okay. same spot. 
I want to use these X's to my advantage, but they're, they're kind of tough, you. yeah. There you go. Okay, so I'm gonna use a small piece because I'm a little chicken on when to use that big one. Okay. <laughs> oh gosh, if I push this way, I'm hurting myself. Oh. Do it. Hurt yourself. Hurt myself. Okay, let's do it. I'm gonna hurt myself. With a small, it's a small piece anyway. I, uh, okay. I just can't, I can't predict where these X's are gonna go for Yeah, me. I don't think anyone really can. can. <laughs> I wanna it's... get these two pieces off. Okay. But also like put you in conflict. So let's go. Oh, uh, that's it. Nothingness. Nice. Oh. Back to me. You're gonna get to go twice because you have your, oh, I get to go actually twice because I have two X's. That's right. Yeah. But it has to be the same platform. Correct, so yeah. So it's your wet work, right? I'm going for it again. Okay. So we are gonna be just, it's just a little backup here. Okay. A little backup, come on, straight. Straight. Straight, straight. Faster. <laughs> okay, okay. That's it. Oh, oh that's, sorry, that's sorry, good. sorry. You're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. I, uh, I, <laughs> you were just defending your purple piece. You're like, I was wait, stop. <laughs> I was speaking on behalf of my of your own self, yeah. Okay, well, it's back to me, and I think I'm going to push from here, so let's switch places. Okay. And by the way, I cannot believe how long we are hanging on. <laughs> there are not yeah. as many pieces left on the board. Yeah, that belt hasn't really moved much. Yeah, that's true. So you know what? I think I'm going to go from here. Mm. Um, and because it's the beginning of my turn, uh, my wrestler is touching my golden web, I can tag a corner. So I don't really see myself going on in this corner. Oops. Okay, I got oh, you. No. I got you. Thank I understand you. what you're trying to do. All there right. You go. And I'm also going to tag this one since I didn't have one there Ooh. yet. Okay. I'm going to go with my medium size. You're going to get that big daddy on? I'm just so afraid of hitting my own piece. Yeah. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. All right. Straight line. Here we go. One, two, three. Come on. Nothingness. Oh, nice. nice. That was great. Ooh. I'm now up against this corner, you which is nice. Are. Nice. Uh, the whole point of these corners, right, is yeah. for these, I think it's called like a rope-a-dope move or something. So, <laughs> is, it, is it really? Something like that. Maybe. I yeah. think it's a wrestling term, maybe. <laughs> I think a rope-a-dope is a boxing thing. Oh, yeah. sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, it's back to me. So I know I will be able to take two turns because my two X's are on the board. I see your sumo wrestler at a mechanical disadvantage here. So I think I'm going to try to go for the W. Okay. If I can. Okay. By using your golden web to my advantage. All right. Oh my gosh. Can I do this? this well, you have a tough. lot of pieces. So you have a lot of pieces. You will be able to push two pieces from this position. I could also hurt myself if I like twist it wrong and then it, like this just stays in spot and then yes. the twist just like knocks my own piece off. But Hopefully that happens. I'm going to Let go. me tag this for you. Oh, thank you. Uh -huh. I'm going to go for it. So let's go ahead and do the medium. I don't want to overdo it. Okay. Oh my gosh. Am I going to be able to pull this off? <laughs> Hopefully not. Okay. Ready? Here we go. Here we go. Go. Oh, oh that gosh. did nothing. Not even on the it did nothing anymore. It did nothing. <laughs> okay. Well, I got one piece. Okay. This is tough. Well, you can push another one from there. Now I'm in danger here. This is not good. I, I'm gonna, I'm going to use the big one. Okay. And man, can this even get to you? I just need to put it where you're scared to try to knock me off. Yeah, so. the corner. The corner is yeah. so good. Oh man, here we go. I'm going to have to straight line. Straight, have you... I know. I'm trying to bring it in like super. I'm just trying to get around this corner. This this thing is a problem. <laughs> Okay. Straight line. Let's yeah, go. Yeah, straight line. Uh, oh, hey, did I go too far? too far. Okay, I went too far. So let's just let's just pretend. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. There. Okay. That's fair. Okay. That's fair. Right. I will okay. say. I messed up. At least you separated my insect I, from my web, so I, I, I cannot use the golden that touch. Is, that is so true. Had they been touching, I would have been able to take two turns back to back. All right. How do we push? this off without pushing myself off mm -hmm. is the question. I think I will go in from this angle. I like it. Because right. uh, it, it is risky, but that is the point that we're at right now. Mm -hmm. I'm going to tag this corner and I think I'm going to go medium. It's time to try to use your X's maybe to my advantage. Here yeah, we go, straight yeah, yeah. line. One, Those two, three. X's are unpredictable, I'm telling you. All oh, right. You got a big dog. I got a nice big one. Okay. Interesting, Monique. Back to you. I mean, I think I can go for it again. I know. I'm in such defend. a dangerous spot. I think this might be the I'm end. I'm surprised huh? you didn't uh, protect yourself this way. Well, if I do it this way, it's going to push you further in also, you know? True, true, true. true. Okay. Right. So I'm not tagging because right. I'm already tagged here. Yeah. So I'm just going to really try to carry them this way. Okay. okay. So let's go. Straight line. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Ah uh, no! <laughs> oh, I was really surprised reason. you didn't you didn't protect yourself this I way. I thought I yeah. was gonna survive there. Yeah, I really did. You didn't see like the the kind of 
turn. I did not. Yeah. Well, anyway. There you go. That was it. You did it. Wait, you let me get my belt. Knocked me out. I'm belting myself. You're belting. Oh. <laughs> You're belting yourself. You win. Unfortunately, the uh, Midas <laughs> Golden Orb Weaver has been squashed today. You did use the touch, though. I did. Yeah. Now, as you can see, this game plays very quickly, yeah. uh, about 10 to 20 minutes. So you could set up and play again. You can also play with a different insect wrestler. So mm -hmm. the game comes with several, and they all have their own signature pieces. Uh, they also have their own signature uh, moves, by mm -hmm. the way, and yep. not all of them are free. Some of them require you to pay uh, tokens, and some of them also require you to stack tokens on top of one another. Mm -hmm. So there's a wide variety of things that you can do with them. And for a simpler game, you can play with the Junior League variant, mm -hmm. which is uh, basically the opposite side of these cards. It lets you start with a starting inventory that includes your signature piece. Right. Uh, it also does not have the power moves, the signature moves that you have to consider. But there you go. Good job. You are the winner Thanks. today. I got the belt. So that is Kabuto Sumo Sakura Slam. This game is currently on Kickstarter. So if you are interested in it, there's a link in the description down below. If you have any questions about anything you saw here, feel free to leave them in the comments and we'll try to get back to you as soon as we can. And lastly, thank you all so much for watching the video. We hope you enjoyed it. If you'd like to see more videos like this in the future, please consider subscribing. Thank you. Thanks. Bye.